Hey, Mo here. All right, I'm gonna show you a way to use your sandbag to increase your strength and power without increasing your risk of injury. Because look, we all need to be stronger. That's just a fact. But oftentimes under heavy load, heavy barbells, and especially if we don't have correct form, our risk of injury goes through the roof. So here's how we can combat that and get what we want strength-wise. It's called tempo work. Maybe you're, you're familiar with doing negatives or eccentric loaded movements. If you're not, here's what that looks like. I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna demonstrate with the deadlifts. So a normal deadlift would be I just drop down, pop back up, that's one. An eccentric load would be I lower the bag under time for maybe four to five seconds. So it's four, three, two, one, and I don't let the bag rest on my feet. I keep the tension in my hamstrings, hold for a second, and then I stand up quickly. Now, if, you don't, if, you're, if your weight is such that you can go heavier and you really wanna work on strength, you can do a tempo of four, four, four. So what I would do now is go four, three, two, one, hold tension in my hamstrings, four, three, two, one, stand slow, four, three, two, one. As soon as I get to the top, there's no pause, right back down, four, three, two, one, hold, four, three, two, one, up slow, three, two, one, and then right back down. So what I would do, I would do about eight to 10 repetitions of that. So you could see from the first movement I did, that took roughly maybe two seconds, three at the most, versus the 16 seconds it took me to do one repetition. So I'm manipulating time under tension in replacement of weight. And it is a phenomenal way for you to gain strength. You could do the same thing with push-ups, overhead presses, pull-ups, any movement that you typically do that you wanna get stronger in, incorporate that. If four seconds is too much, start with three, 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 four, four, four. I would build up to where you can do five by fives. So a five second eccentric load, a five second pause, and then a five second concentric contraction back up to the top or whatever movement it is you're doing, okay? So give that a shot. Let us know, let us know how you do.